Yes. So I'm going to mark. You got scissors. Great. Do we know anything about this? Paramedics know anything about this guy? So this is where I'm going to mark right here. I'm going to go ahead. The Branford Mobile Medical Simulation Laboratory is a low-cost, high-fidelity simulation training center. We are proud to be making simulation training accessible to the community-based healthcare professional. We strongly believe that simulation education has become the gold standard for the learning and maintenance of resuscitation skills. In addition, it is a great tool for optimizing multidisciplinary team functioning and ultimately patient outcomes. Hi, my name is Andrea Unger. I'm one of the ER physicians here at the Brantford General. I'm very excited to be involved in SIM training. This is revolutionary for a small hospital like ours. This is the kind of thing that takes place at a major teaching center, and it gives us the opportunity to be prepared for things that don't happen every day. It's hard as an emergency doctor to never know what's coming in and be prepared for every kind of emergency. So to practice with simulation gets us prepared to handle whatever comes. It also lets us work with our peers so that we can improve together as a group because when it comes to these life-saving moments, we have to work together as a team. So we need a pair of blood scissors or we can use Okay, off the laceration tray. <laughs> Through the use of standardized patient actors, procedure mannequins, and realistic anatomic models, we are able to recreate the high stress environment of the resuscitation bay. This allows the team to familiarize themselves with the actual equipment of their emergency department and provides an opportunity to hone communication skills in a fast paced, high stakes setting. I've been here for approximately 22, 23 years. Um, the simulation has been a great experience. It, it allows uh, members of the staff to share their experience, um, some older staff with uh, the lesser experienced staff. The simulation is a, a good practical reminder of skills that we should all have by this point in time. It's very good. So the lungs are definitely down. down. Uh, I'm Dr. Greg Hall. Uh, I'm the Director of Emergency Medicine Ultrasound and one of the emergency physicians here at Brantford General Hospital. And we're just in the process of uh, completing uh, our simulation trauma day uh, that uh, Dr. Kiefer and Dr. Higgins have put together. Um, it's, uh, I think it's an excellent program. Uh, they're doing a lot of work to uh, um, develop this. In terms of what it's offering us, it's offering us a chance to do uh, procedures that we don't come up every day, we may only come up once or twice in our careers, uh, to think through how we manage a lot of our high stress, um, fast acting uh, situations and also help develop teamwork, uh, communication skills. So I think it's, they're working to a very um, useful uh, endpoint. It involves a lot of thinking on your feet. They are putting pressure on you and yet it's in an environment where we can all learn and share knowledge. Uh, so uh, I think it's an excellent program and uh, I'm looking forward to them developing uh, to even greater uh, degrees. Tanya, when you're done hanging that have there been any lab drops? That's what we should just order. Yeah. Just order lab. <coughs> just order blood work? Or, yeah, and... Can we, can we just get a portable chest as well? I can order that. So we have a 25-year-old. He's stab wound, he had a pericardial fusion, and a cardiac laceration.